said that. <laughs> he said 10-4, yes, yes you can. <laughs> okay, we're still rolling. So. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm Mike Fisher, and I run the Sixth Street Massacre Haunted House. I started the hunt about 13 years ago. A little longer than that, we started on our garage, on our, in our garage and on the front porch, scaring kids in the neighborhood. I always told myself I wanted to have a house that the kids, you know, all remembered and wanted to go to, you know, that, that house in the neighborhood where all the kids from the hood would go to, like, because I was one of those kids in the hood. And once I, you know, once we lived in that neighborhood, I always said I was gonna be that house. And the very first year we lived in that neighborhood, started it on the porch and then three years later it turned into about 300 people showing up at my house on halloween night so it all evolved from there we started uh just renting out buildings where it, where it is today was it, that's a big part of it is a lot of the people that we just kind of stumbled across you know i think we have a positive effect on a lot of kids like in this neighborhood we're in a kind of underserved underprivileged neighborhood and we have about 200 actors and they're all volunteer and i feel like we have a really positive effect on these kids we we set up boundaries and they come here and they get the respect and structure that you know those kids need when their teenage years evolving into adults and i think we're having a, a huge effect on these kids the biggest challenge i've faced renting a haunted house is the fun gets taken out of it i'm doing a lot for the community giving a lot back to the community we get a, a lot of grief from you know the technical side of things like the business side of things when people become successful, they buy a boat, buy a yacht, you become more successful, you keep buying more bigger boats, upgrading the boat. This is my boat. And I think it goes back to all those things. We'll, we work with the blood bank, we give away $40,000 in free passes. We help them go to that next generation and, and teach them to donate. I feel like it's evolved into giving back uh, to the community. And this is what makes me tick. And I'd love to share what makes me tick with everybody else. You can call me killer Cause I'll bring you to the light And it might taste bitter When you're answering to God You can call me killer 